Cut flowers are no longer just a gift for a special occasion. We use them to brighten up our indoors, be it home or in the office. Well, today I'm going to take you behind the scenes and show you a wholesale flower operation to see what's in season and how to keep those blooms lasting longer. One of the keys to quality in flowers is the colour of the foliage. Look for rich dark green leaves as a sign that the plant's been well fed. Roses are still the best loved flowers the world over. By holding these in cool storage, the blooms remain in a state of suspended animation. This means that you get to enjoy the gradual opening of these tight buds into full flowers. Jurebras come originally from South Africa and have vibrant sunny colours that really lift your spirits. Tulips have always been an exotic bloom for me because they grow best in colder climates than you find in Perth. These kale are an ornamental cabbage. The colours are so unusual, they can't help but catch your eye. Chrysanthemums are one of the world's top cut flowers and revel in cooler winter conditions. And the protea family, which includes banksias. These bring a different dimension a sort of a bush feel to floral arrangements. The blooms are long lasting and very intricate. Now here's a home brew to keep your flowers lasting longer. Take a teaspoon of sugar, a teaspoon of vinegar and a couple of drops of household bleach. Put them all into a litre of water, give them a quick stir and that can go straight into your vase. Now when you unwrap your flowers, the first thing you do is cut off about a centimetre at the bottom and any of the leaves that'll finish up in the water when you place them in the vase. Once you've done that, it can go into the vase and it's ready to make a long show. Well, I hope I might have inspired you to head down to your local florist shop and pick up a bunch of fresh flowers to put a sparkle in the eye of the one that you love or your surroundings. <laughs>